Thanks to you, we get to see what really happens when you fall off the islands. Hey, you can't pin this on me! This is your fault! Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. Trusting the blaze rods, hiding the Eversource. I didn't do any of that! Hmm, I can't decide whether I want our death to be painless for my sake or excruciating for yours. Impossible. That's impossible. Jesse? There. Can we get to it in time? It's going to be close. You're down here too? Lucas! You made it! Oh, yeah, only slightly worse for wear. Ah, gotta say, Aiden's tougher than I remember. Mm. Got me pretty good. I'm just so glad you're okay. When Aiden pitched you over the side, that was awful. Yeah, I wasn't a huge fan either. <laughs> ah. That was good of you to try and save the founder. Uh, speaking of whom. Is she okay? She's just sort of staring. Let me ask. Founder! Miss Founder? I, uh, hope she's not in shock or something. Are you, uh, doing okay over there? I just, I, I can't believe it. <sighs> mm. This has been down here the whole time. I forbade anyone to look for land below us. It was too dangerous. A, a lost cause. I just don't understand. Why did you never even look? Send someone down. Hey, take it easy. She's having a rough enough day as it is. No, no. That's okay. I, I was too cautious. I didn't want to create false hope. And I was so certain that the only thing down here was death. Look at this place. Totally untouched biomes all around us. Yes, it's all a little overwhelming. What, what do I do now? Well, how about you start with a few deep breaths? <laughs> Seeing all this after you've been crammed on a tiny island, that would be overwhelming for anybody. You can bring all of your people down here. They won't have to to petition for resources, or any of that stuff anymore. I... I suppose you're right. Yes. We have to go back up and tell them. Getting back up. My word, you're right. We need to do that. I hadn't even thought that far ahead yet. That's not a good sign. It's definitely a bad sign. Your city's probably in big trouble right now. I can't believe Aiden could be so stupid. I can't leave my subjects in whatever trouble they're in. Jesse, will you please help me get back to Sky City? Stop Aiden. Help me protect my people. We did kind of start this mess. Of course, I'll help you. You're the founder. Thank you, Jesse. And please, call me Issa. Okay, getting back up. Getting back up. Let me see what we've got to work with. Hmm. That'll work. What is it? Ah, oh, I see where you're getting at. Nice. Well, what... Someone care to explain it to me, please? Get ready to build something huge! Maybe the biggest thing of your life. What do you mean? 
We're going to build a tower of dirt all the way back up to Sky City. Grab as much dirt as you can carry. Okay, that should do it. Jesse, what is that? What? What is it? Just... Wow, what are the odds? It's the other half of the portal that brought me here. Man, what a relief. I mean, once you get that flint and steel back, it should be a straight shot home now. Well, guys, ready? Yes, I, I think so. I, uh... I think I actually gotta sit this one out, Jesse. It got me pretty good. Just not sure I'm up for towering all the way back up there. Look, I'm really sorry. I probably wouldn't be able to keep up anyway. What? But it's dangerous alone. Monsters, nightfall. I'll get some food, put together a shelter if it gets dark. It's not my first rodeo. There you go, buddy. Thank you for trying to help. It was very noble. Hey, what's with the last goodbye tone? I'll see you guys when you get back. Oh, and give Aiden another punch for me. Will do. Come on, we've got an epic climb ahead of us. We've got a city to save. Ready? I believe so. And when I get up there, I'm going to tear those blaze rods limb from limb. Oh, and Jesse, I appreciate what you did up there. Trying to save me, I mean. under attack by monsters, ma'am. Everywhere. They seem to be coming from inside the palace itself. Aiden! Come on! We need to stop him! I'm sorry, Jesse, but I have to save my people. Take care of yourself out there, okay? And to you as well. Jesse! You're alive! Please, can you help us? Hang tight, Milo! Quick on your feet. But with all seriousness, how are you alive? I saw you go over the edge. Quick version? You know how you all thought there was nothing but void below you? Yes. Yeah, that was wrong. There's land. You speak truthfully, my friend? No. Well, I can't wait to hear all about it later. I gotta get to the palace. Thank you, my friend. We'll see you on the other side. <laughs>
Aiden has taken over the palace. He's holed up in the throne room, throwing those spawn eggs everywhere. No one can get inside! We need to stop him. I know. Jesse, take one of these. They're all locally sourced and handcrafted. I use only the best ingredients. Give me a potion of speed. Here! If you don't shut up! Now you listen here! I'm the captain of the guard! You can't just talk to me that way! I'll talk to you however I want, Reggie! Hey, jerkwad! Leave him alone! I saw you fall! You went down! You're alive! You're alive! He's the founder with you! <laughs> what the... Reggie! Not one more step! I killed you once! I could do it again! You thought you could just kick me off the edge? Unfortunately for you, Aiden, I'm pretty tough to kill. Just... die already! Should've left while you had the chance! Someone else in the spotlight, can you? You just can't let anyone else win. Oh, it just drives you crazy to see someone else succeed, doesn't it? Aiden, this isn't about who wins and who loses. It's about what's right. And that is why you're gonna lose. Everything you've done, 
I'm not sure you deserve that kind of mercy. No, 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 come on! You can't just leave me behind! If you leave me here, I'll die! I thought you were the good guys! You're coming with us. Th th thank you. Thank you, Jesse. <laughs> <laughs> More than you deserve, frankly. Jesse's word. you enough. You've saved us all. So what do we do now? Everything's just so different and scary. But exciting? What do you do? You go have fun. You guys were cooped up there so long. Now you can do whatever you want. Uh, uh, oh. Freeze, criminals. You're not going anywhere. I knew you'd stop him. Nice work. Now, this is just speculation, but I'm guessing they have some regrets. I knew they wouldn't get away. Ooh, I bet the blaze rods are in for a bad time. These Sky City people are not happy with them. Yeah, hopefully they dig a deep hole, bury them in it, surround it with lava, and... Sorry, got a little carried away there. Aiden. Oh, uh, hi, Jesse. I'm, uh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to cause all that trouble. I can see where it all went wrong. I've, uh, got some regrets, to say the least. I hope you learned a lesson, Aiden. This didn't have to happen like this. I'd say you have a lot to think about. Yeah, yeah, that's for sure.
try and make a fresh start, okay, Aiden? Do something good for these guys. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Make myself a little house. Maybe I'll become a writer. I won't try to compete with you anymore. Attention! Attention! Hello, hello, everyone, please. This is your founder speaking. Now that we're all safe, we need to organize. Start planning our new community. Are you listening to yourself? That's insane! We were prisoners long enough on that island in the sky. It is time for us to run free. Build whatever we please. Wow, those two just cannot get along. Jesse, I cannot allow my people to be influenced by this naive idealist. Bah! I'm sure I do look like a naive idealist through the eyes of an oppressive dictator. Watch your tongue, mister. Just relax a minute, okay? Relax? Relax? My people are in more danger than they ever have been, and you want me to relax? No, you don't understand. It will be night soon, and that is when the monsters come out. If we don't prepare, we'll be in danger. You're just making excuses to control our behavior, just like before. We must trust in ourselves, be able to learn from our mistakes. The people need to build! W what do we do? Who are we supposed to listen to? Of course the people can build, but we need a system, some rules. Rules aren't bad. This is all very confusing. Well, I think you're both right. You don't want to just run around with no plan. But you can't schedule and organize everything either. People need to be free to try new things. But you gotta be safe about it. I suppose I still have much to learn. Thank you, Jesse. I don't understand yet, but I trust you. Well, Jesse, I suppose the era of Sky City is over. We may disagree about how to run this place. But I thank you for everything you have done. I guarantee that we will be telling stories about your visit for many, many years to come. The day that Sky City was liberated. This is a second chance at making a civilization. Don't waste it, okay? I don't intend to. I give my solemn oath. You know something? She was a little scary at first, but... She's all right. <laughs> I'm gonna miss that crazy guy. I guess we should prepare for Nightfall too. Without another portal, we're stuck here. Been a while since I've had to start from square one. Ugh, just when I thought my days of punching trees were behind me. Aw, oh, come on, Ivor, it could be fun. That would be the case. But luckily, you had me as your advanced scout. When I was on the ground with the founder before, I totally found the portal. And you didn't say anything? Yeah. I'm actually gonna have to agree with Ivor on this one. Did I not mention it either? Cause I could have sworn I said something. No, you didn't. Huh. I guess the moment just never presented itself. Come on. Oh, hi. Ah, oh, there you are. I'm so sorry about her. That's okay. It looks like she's having fun running around. Yes, I think she took it pretty well when I told her she didn't need to be the Eversource anymore. What are we gonna do with you now, huh? What are you going to do now? Besides, continue to be adorable, of course. <laughs> but that was a given. You're not going to eat her, are you? Don't be morbid, of course not. After so long being the founder and the Eversource, now we can just be Isa and her best friend. Benedict. Ah, uh, that's a boy's name. Huh, what a closed-minded attitude. Jesse, I would be honored if you would take this as a small token of our gratitude. Thank you. Come along, Benedict. We have a lot of adventures ahead of us. Well, there goes the Eversaurs. Off to cluck and peck at seeds for the rest of its valuable life. Hey, Jesse. You okay? Jesse? Oh, I just saw those pigs and, you know. Oh, yes. He would be really happy to know you're still having adventures like this. See, just like I told you, one portal back home. 
I just can't wait to put this whole world behind us. Oh, is someone being grumpy? No, a little. I was just hoping for a real treasure is all. <laughs> Livestock's no proper treasure. Although I wonder what would happen if you put that tiny crown on a different chicken. Come on, guys. Let's go home. Wait till Axel and Olivia hear where we've been. They'll never believe... It... That's... Not what I was expecting.